And a reminder, summer is almost here. Before you head to the beach or lay by the pool, you're going to want to think about your skin, especially because skin cancer is so common. And sunscreen is an important part of protecting yourself. We have board-certified dermatologist Dr. Sherry Ingerham here from Advanced Dermatology with a little lesson on sunscreen 101. Yes. Good to see you. Good to see you. So first, I want to talk about this, this new fight in our, uh, you know, protection it's a, in a form of a pill, right? Tell right. me about that. So Helio Care is a very exciting product in sun protection. This pill, the research came out about 10 years ago, and mm -hmm. since then it's been gaining some notoriety. And essentially, it's a Honduran fern extract called Polypodium leucotomos. Mm -hmm. And what that is is a very powerful antioxidant. You know, you've heard of antioxidants in green tea and other things we recommend people ingesting to prevent sun damage. This is just a very potent form of that. And what you want to do is take one, even the first day you're going to be out in the sun, you can start today, take mm -hmm. one in the morning. If you're going to be in the sun all day long, I tell patients playing golf, tennis, being in a marathon, mm -hmm. take a second one at lunchtime. But on a normal day, you just want to take one a day, and it actually kind of increases your body's own defense against the sun. Okay, and now it doesn't replace sunscreen though, right? No, you still no. want to... You still do. I tell my patients, you know, you want to floss and brush, right? So you want to wear a broad spectrum UVA, UVB sunscreen, SPF 30 or higher every day, but we all know we sweat, it rubs off, you get in and out of the pool. This gives you that added protection, especially if you forget to apply to an area like your ears, the back of your mm -hmm. neck. This kind of covers your whole body. Okay, so it's called HelioCare. You can get it at a drugstore or your dermatologist's exactly. office. All right, when it comes to sunscreen, doctor, let's talk about the sprays, the lotions. What should we be looking for when choosing? In any sunscreen, the main thing you're looking for is SPF 30. That's number one. You okay. want to get that. That gives you about a 97% coverage against the sun. Anything above 30 is incremental because you can only go as high as 100. Mm -hmm. Below 30 is no longer recommended by the American Academy of Dermatology. You want UVA and UVB. So those are the rays that penetrate into the skin to cause damage. UVA rays are longer and they actually penetrate through car windows. And the UVA are the bad ones. Those are the ones that cause sun damage, mm -hmm. melanoma, all of that damage to our DNA. UVB are the burning rays. So you want UVA and UVB. Okay, and then also look for water or sweat resistant right. too. And the labeling has changed. The FDA now only lets labels say water resistant. There's no such thing as waterproof. So water resistant can last either 40 to 80, 40 or 80 minutes. So you want to look for that on the bottle. Great. Really good advice this morning. Thank you so much for coming in, Dr. Absolutely. Ingraham. We appreciate you making us aware so that we can all remember to put that sunscreen on. Don't forget. Right, Caitlin?